my name is Sarah. I am 21 years old. I do modeling and I live in Toronto, Ontario. Um, I wasn't always the happy girl that I, I, I am today. I struggled a lot from anxiety, depression, and eating disorder. And I just want to talk about this and share this. I had bulimia for two years. At that moment, I was not confident at all, not happy at all. It affected me a lot. It affected every aspect of my life. And I slowly started to notice something's not right. It did take a while. I took an outpatient program at the hospital three times a week. I saw a therapist two times a week and I saw the doctor two times a week so they could measure me and whatnot. And then slowly but surely I just started eating more and more and more. Sarah is a one of a kind woman. She's an individual and she has a very strong mind. So Ryan, he helped me out a lot because we did a lot of photo shoots together. Sarah and I have a great friendship. Uh, we really enjoy spending time of walking the dogs together uh, and hanging out. And I really enjoy that sort of working bond that we have with one another. Because she's come from a difficult past, I find her to be very uh, open uh, with others, understanding of others, and she's very non-judgmental. He believed in me, it made me feel so much more confident uh, that you know I actually had some talent. It just helped me a lot by just you know looking at my body in the right way. She's come from uh, a tough past, and she's been through uh, a lot to get to where she is today. And I don't think a lot of people have that kind of strength to be transparent about where they've come from. And I admire that a lot about Sarah that. She owns it and she lives with it every day and she remembers it, but she works really hard uh, to feel better about herself. All my activities, like I, you know, dancing really kept me positive and modeling. I think she's developed excellent skills to cope with her feelings. She's able to think about it a bit more uh, and, and maybe even talk about it with me or her friends before she gets to a reactive episode or a reactive point where it gets bad. And I think that that's a wonderful skill set that she's developed and if she continues to develop that skill set and focus on controlling those feelings, um, I think it will be very beneficial for her uh, for her future. It's been four years since I had bulimia. I'm just proud of where I am today and how far I've come. And it's no longer a part of me.